I get asked a lot about my gear, so I want to just give you a brief tour about what I'm, of what I'm playing today. Um, I'm playing my Strat 56 uh, Rally Custom Shop. Um, it's pretty much straightforward. Um, I just put like heavier frets on it, and um, the pickups are Fender pickups. I overwound the ba the bridge pickup to make it a little thicker. Um, I use pretty heavy strings, so the set that I'm using, I've used the Darius strings, 11 set. Uh, the top string is a 12, and the bottom string is a 48. The rest is a set of 11, the Daria. And um, I tune regularly to E. I don't tune down or anything like that. The amp is a 73 Marshall head, 50 watt, that uh, my tech, Ziv Nagari, he takes care of all my rig. He basically modifies it and, you know, makes sure it sounds great. And um, then it's plugged into the ultimate attenuator to just make sure that uh, I'm not going to blow my head off with the volume of the head because um, I'm sitting pretty close to the amp right now. Um, and then I'm plugging it into a 412 Bad Cat cabinet with uh, four greenback 25s. So I use the 2.0 line six pod just so there's a, as a direct signal for safety um, and um, I use it a lot actually I really like the sound of it and then um, I get asked a lot about my pedals so I'll give you a brief uh, look at that uh, my, I'm plugging my guitar straight into exotic pedal Robotalk and it's got like a this envelope filter thing <coughs> and then an arpeggiator <coughs> From there, I'm just going to a regular crybaby wah that, again, my tech, Steve Nagari, uh, modified. From there, I go to a Fulton Octophase. From there, I go into a LA sound design uh, buffer. That's, uh, well, that's, it's just a buffer, basically, with in, uh, ins and outs. Um, and then from there, I'm going into a exotic uh, RC booster for like a, it's just like a very clean boost. If this is a signal. Just boost it a little, uh, boost it a little bit. From there, it goes to the Blackstone. That's another boost, a little heavier. Then the Tube Screamer 808. Out of that, I'm going to um, this thing called an Atomic Overdrive by XTS. Uh, this guy in Dallas, a friend of mine, Greg Walton, makes these really, really great pedals. And this pedal is really, really great. It's just a really heavy distortion. It's something that's really hard to get from a pedal, but it, this thing sounds great. <laughs> So this is the booster part of the pedal board. Now, from here on, it goes to all these uh, corky effects. So I have uh, this really fast tremolo, the tremo uh, tremolator by Demeter. From there, it goes into an MXR Phase 90. Out of that, it goes to a stereo Dunlop tremolo. And then into a Rotosim uh, DLS effect Rotosim. That's like the Leslie simulator. Then it gets back into the buffer and coming out into a DD7 by Boss, DD7 delay pedal. And that pedal is always on, it's just a slap that I keep on all the time. So from the Boss DD7, I'm going into the M13 Line 6 uh, Stompbox modeler. And uh, the way I use it is uh, 